Hello everybody. Now today we are start about a starfish robins. A starfish, commonly called starfish. Their phylum is Echinodermata. Their class is Asteroidea. Their order is Forfici Pulata. The genus is Asteris and their species robins. As you see here, this animal having the five pair of lamb, five la uh, arms, in which uh, a oral and oral side and the oral side contains mouths and this five arms contains spines now about their habitat they live having free living marine animal shaped is star shaped animal this animal having penta maras radial symmetry the color is mainly yellow pink and purple they are having numerous calcareous ossicles as a part of their exoskeleton they are having true swilom. Their feeding is omnivorous and they are va having water vascular system. This animal having open type of circulatory system. Mainly respiration of this animal is by dermal branchia or papillia. The excretion is by amoid beard corpuscles. The sex organs are neurosensory cells and the eyes. These animals are mainly unisexual or dioecious animal. The fertilization is always external. This having indirect development. Now about their body development. About their body consists of indistinct central disc with tapering arms and rays. They are having torso ventral body. The upper surface is called aboral which is convex in nature, in convex in seen and the lower surface is oral which is in flat seams. Their oral surface have central disc which having mouth. Their mouth is surrounded by a soft membrane called peristome membrane. Their upper convex surface covered with stout or immovable calcareous spicules. Between this a small soft papule or gill present which is as a respiratory in function. Now ab about their epidermis. Skin layers. The first is epidermis which consists ciliated columnar cells and neurosensory cells. The epidermis covered with externally two layer thin cuticles. As you see here they are body surfaces. They are having spines, epidermis, neurosensory cells, gland cells cuticle epidermis, basement cells and the many more. The dermis consists is thicker mesodermal in origin and composed of fibril connective tissue. The muscular root made up of smooth muscle fiber. The stomach epithelium is lining lining with silom consists cubidal serrated cell called parental peritoneum. The mouth is at oral surface sounded by peristome membrane guarded by sphincter muscles. The oesophagus is short tube open in stomach open type. The stomach having the cardio stomach as a part of the stomach and the pyruvic stomach. The cardiac stomach have pentagonal sac capable for being inverted outside. The pyloric stomach is flat pentagonal sac open like above into intestine now about the intestine which is five sided divided tube extended tube vertically to a boral surface their anus is small rounded aperture and somewhat eccentrically the digesting gland called pyloric system each of them consists granular pouches. Pyloric system formed four flagellated columnar cells as flagellated cells, secretory cells, mucus cells, and the storage cells. Now their circulatory system is hemaltype in starfish, which is communicating channel filled with stomach fluid. About their nervous system is very simple and primitive. 
connective by skin except visceral nerve plexus. They having four parts. The first one superficial system, which is ready below the epidermis, consists of consists of curcuminal nerve ring, radial nerve cord, and their sub epidermal plexus. Their deep hyponeural nervous system consists radial nerve with radial abulacral vessels of each arm. The aboral system consists situated in aboral body wall outside parental peritoneum and their visceral ma nerval nervous system located in gut wall gut just outside enteric epithelium. They having neurosensory cell which present throughout the epidermis it have two types tactile around the two feet and olfactory around mouth. Their eyes is five small bright red color spot under base of tentacles. They having one they having a pair of gonads in each arm elongated with branch branch body. Their fertilization takes place in spring and induced by rising spring temperature. Development is indirect eggs undergo rapid unequal intermediate cleavage and they having the most important tract of these animals having great power of regenerate their lost body part. That's all about asteris.